All right, so hi you guys. Today is Thursday the 7th, yeah. And I'm gonna show you guys my progress in me packing. Uh, I feel like this has been such a hectic, not hectic, but it's very hard to move. Like I never moved from one apartment to another apartment. So it's kind of like all new to me. And I'm like, what do I do? So in the living room here, as you can see, there's like boxes literally everywhere. Um, and I did get a new camera. I got a new vlogging camera. I got the G7X Mark II, by the way. So this looks much better. But anyway, um, over here we have my tree, which my mom is gonna move. I have boxes, I have my couch, the lamp. I still have to paint my wall back to white. I have to prime it, so I'm gonna do that on Sunday. Um, my lease is up here on Monday on the 10th, but I'm moving into my other place officially Saturday. Um, my lease starts at my new place on the 8th, which is Friday, which is tomorrow, but I'm not gonna be sleeping there until Saturday because I won't have a bed until Saturday to put in there. So why does my eyebrows look like that? Okay. So I will be sleeping at my parents' house Friday night in my old bed. But okay, so over here my couch um, and a lot of stuff. So I wash some clothes and they're on the floor. I'm just gonna put those in a box. Um, I have a lot of boxes over here as y'all can see, like tons of boxes big boxes so I'm actually about to go to U-Haul so I can get another one of these boxes this wardrobe box I was able to fit a good amount into my box so I'm gonna get one more and hopefully I'll be good enough um, I have some boxes over here <sighs> my room looks a mess my room looks like I have done nothing to it like if you look behind I took the curtains down my makeup I mean, I can literally throw that in a box and call it a day. Cause I did get new makeup drawers. So I don't, I'm don't gonna throw those old ones away anyway. I took all the stuff out of my workout. This dresser is so big like. I took all this stuff. This is my workout dresser. So I took all the workout clothes out of there. And then this dresser over here that I have um, I took stuff uh, out of the bottom three. Um, so I gotta take stuff out of this one. I took stuff out of this one. And I gotta take stuff out of this one. And uh, yeah, so my bathroom. I have my suitcase here because when I stay with my parents, I gotta pack my suitcase. My bathroom looks horrendous. I'm about to put a work order in because my sink is clogged and my bathtub is clogged. And I want to clean this stuff before I leave, so I need to be unclogged, you know? Yeah. Um, I think I'm going to sell a lot of my clothes on Poshmark. Um, I know people were saying, like, now's the perfect time to, like, get rid of clothes, which I did, like, a couple months ago. But I'm going to do that again because Poshmark, I can actually get money for them. So I will have a Poshmark available soon for you guys so you can buy the clothes if you would like them. So anyway, right now, let me sit in my bed. So, oh, my arm hurts holding this thing. So right now, um, I called the leasing office at my new place so I can look at the unit before I even sign my lease or move in. And they said it's not ready yet and I move in tomorrow. So they said, earlier he said, call back it'll probably be ready around two or three called back and it's still not ready so he said probably more like five so that just changed my whole plans because i was gonna go to the other side and get sushi because it's sushi dollar sushi day there but now i'm not going over there until like five so the new place i'm moving to is not that far away for me it's probably like 10 minutes away but I don't want to go over there and then come back and then go back over. So I'm just going to go to Kroger and get sushi and get some ginger ale and I need to get some more boxes. So that's what I'm going to do. Nizow. So I get home 
and that wardrobe box I got, I forgot to get the rail for it. So with that box, we have to like get the rails. Oh my God, this person's taking forever to back in. Okay, so when you get the wardrobe box, you have to get the rail that goes with it so you can hang your clothes up and the guy did not remind me to get it. Last time I got it, the guy was like, oh, don't forget the rail, you're gonna need that. And me being like a real first time mover, like I don't know what goes with the box. Like, so anyway, I have to go back to, what is this place called? U-Haul to get the stinking rail. Hurry up. Great, I'm gonna miss the light because of you, thanks a lot. So, I gotta go to U-Haul and get this rail. Y'all, I'm so hungry. Like, I think I had acid reflux this morning because I woke up and, it's really cold outside. I woke up and I had the uncured turkey bacon and pineapples. And I lay back down and went to sleep. And y'all, like the top part of my stomach was hurting so bad. It wasn't like I had to use the bathroom. It was just like a really bad stomach pain. Like I wanted to cry. It was so bad. So um, I looked up stuff to get rid of it. And I took like two shots of apple cider vinegar. And eventually it went away. Y'all, this just came on in my car. I don't know what the heck this means. I'm about to Google it. Like, I turned my steering wheel and it started making a noise. And now is not the time to be going through this. So I'm about to go to the Mercedes dealership because down the street from me, luckily, and ask them what the heck this means because I'm freaking out. Okay, so I looked it up and it mainly has to do with the airbag, I think. But yeah, it's the airbag. There's something off the airbag, which I need to work in case I get in a car accident or I'm gonna die, you know? So, I'm about to go to dealership now real quick and just have them tell me what it is and when I could get it fixed because, I mean, I'm really I'm not trying to get it fixed today. Um, I just want to know like how big of an issue it is right now. Uh, I would love to get it fixed today, but it's just, there's so much going on this week that I need to wait until next week. Let's see. So, yeah, I have my headscarf on. I look a little dolled up because I did record a video about a wig. I went to record it before I moved, so when I move, I don't have to worry about doing that video as soon as possible. But um, I'm gonna give you guys another update. So it's Thursday at like eight o'clock p.m. And this is my room still. My bed, like my bedroom is not gonna be done until tomorrow because I have to sleep in my bed. I gotta do my makeup in the morning. So basically my bedroom's going to be like this. But I did get other stuff done. So we walk into the bathroom. Um, I don't want y'all to see my sink because they still didn't come fix it yet. But uh, I have some stuff done over here. I know I need to take my trash out. Um, bathtub, I took all that stuff off of it. You guys know what I just went through. Went, I forgot to pick up the rail for it and then Go back to U-Haul, leave U-Haul. My car gets messed up. Whole another story. So I have to wake up extra early tomorrow to go to a dealership. And I got the wrong size rail for this thing. So I have to go back to U-Haul tomorrow and get the correct size rail so I can hang the wardrobe stuff up. And right now I'm making a pizza. This is a pizza that I'm making. It's California white pizza touch the rail with my thumb. All right, so this is the Delicioso white pizza. Um, I think I have something to cut it with still. I don't wanna use that knife. Aha. Uh -huh. So I basically put everything up, so like I'm very limited on what I can use to eat with. I'm gonna have to eat my pizza out of this thing right here. Ooh. Good morning! So it is bright and early this beautiful morning. I don't know why I have so much energy. Oh, what time is it? It's Friday. It's 1021. Oh my god, I gotta be at the dealership and like I cannot prop this up while I put my watch on. I have to be at the dealership in 
uh, 25 minutes, 20 minutes. Yeah, make sure I have everything. I'm going to the dealership to get whatever is wrong, fix. Whatever's wrong with my car, I need to get it fixed. I got a truck. Y'all, it took me forever to figure out how to work this car. Um, it looks completely different, I'll show y'all. It looks completely different from mine. But um, this is so dangerous. I need to put this down because um, there's no stand. There's no way I can hold my, not hold, but prop my camera up. So I actually have to hold it. So I'm not gonna really vlog and drive because that's dangerous. So see you guys when I get to my destination. Okay, so I'm back home. I came to get a money order. Well, I have to go get a money order. Um, so I came to pick this rod up so I can return it to U-Haul. Go to the bank and get a money order and then I'm gonna go to my new apartment to see what it's looking like. And then I'm gonna come home and take a nap so I'm really tired, okay? All right, so I got my money order finally. I went to U-Haul, y'all can't see me. Okay, so I went to U-Haul and returned the stuff. Well, I exchanged it. So, um, I was about to say, I went to the bank first to try to get a money order, but Bank of America said that they don't do money orders anymore. So, I went to Kroger and they did it. So now I'm about to go to the apartment uh, and I wanna look at it. Um, the guy said I can go ahead and sign my lease online. I'm not sign my lease until I look at my apartment. Um, so yeah, so we're about to head over there and I'll show you guys what the apartment looks like. So I'm at my new apartment. Like, your video is a little bit oh yeah, no you're fine. And this amazing guy right here, Nathan. Oh, you wanna see yourself, Nathan? There you go, bam. I'm gonna put my name <laughs> I want to pair. <laughs> Nathan is amazing. He helped me out so much. I already love him. Appreciate him. He's the best. <laughs> and this is great. The proper man just way great. This is great. Hey, what is <laughs> this is the property this, manager. This is Morgan's blog right here. This is what? Her blog. And oh, blog? What? I gotta give a shout out to Rob <laughs> Maintenance. <laughs> this is Rob. Right. Coolest Top flight, man. coolest. We'll take care of her. The whole her whole rodeo. Yes. <laughs> and he cooks. Yeah. Everything. Deep fried fries. Okay, you guys, so I just walked inside and the lighting is actually already pretty good for it to, for me not to change the lights out yet. But this is it and I'm gonna show you guys around. So I'm gonna do a little walkthrough tour. So this is the front door when you come in. And I really like the floors here too. So this is the kitchen and I'm just so happy that I have a an island now because before I didn't, and there's so much storage in it. So, I love the countertops too. So this is the kitchen, and I like the brown. I did, they do have white, and I really want the white, but I couldn't get the white, because there are no more available. Um, so like some of the units are white and some are brown, but this still looks very nice. So I have the brown over here, the nice sinks. And then over here, have a little closet area. And then here is my living room. I love this. One thing I just didn't like were the blinds. Like, I hate <laughs> these blinds that, you know, are long and go back and forth, but it's okay. So, this is the living room. You walk in, so it's very, very spacious. Much bigger than my old place. And then we have a little balcony. And is this locked? The opening. So. And they just repaint it. Oh my god, you guys, there's a screen on here. I was definitely about to walk out. Um, so yeah, so here's the balcony. And this is one of the two pools. So there's a pool right there. 
and they also that's the lap pool but they also have they also have another pool like where more people go block this thing Um, and here it's my bedroom and this is it very spacious um, I'm trying to figure out where I'm gonna put my bed I think I want to put my bed like against the wall I don't want it like in the middle because I'm trying to get a lot of space so I think I'm gonna put it against the wall um, and then there's actually lights in here y'all I'm about to go to the store and get new light bulbs and get LED lights to put in here too. And then over here is the bathroom. How do you turn? I love this bathroom. Okay, how do you, okay. All right, so walking in, here's the bathroom and double sinks, which is great. I have storage in here, like, yes. Didn't have that before. Um, hi. So double sinks, the same color cabinets. I'm gonna switch these out and put LED lights in them. The toilet, the bathtub, and then my nice big closet. Y'all really can't tell how big it is, but it's very spacious closet here. So I have my big closet, hang all my stuff up. I'm gonna put my dresser right here. And then, over here, we have the washer and dryer. I don't know how to turn the light on over here yet, but the washer and dryer. And then we have this place for my iMac. So I can put my iMac here um, in this area. And then when you come back, it is the kitchen. So yeah, so I'm just really happy with move I made this just can't talk this decision because um yeah I got what I wanted now and I'm on like a higher floor so I don't have to worry about trees like in my way blocking natural sunlight or any of that so yeah so right now I'm about to go to my old apartment finish packing eat something um do all that and then I'm gonna start moving stuff over to this one. And I will be spending the night with my parents tonight because at any minute, the electricity is gonna go off at my old apartment and my bed is gonna be broken down today. So I won't have anywhere to sleep. So um, look how cool this is when the door opens. It has this symbol on the ground hey y'all like look it's legit snowing outside look can y'all see that it's really snowing and it's sticking so yes it really snows in Atlanta but now I'm like I feel like I'm stuck in a crisis because my mom is supposed to be on the way here from their house to help me pack and so I gotta move stuff from my place to my new place my old place to my new place luckily both of my places have parking decks so we're not gonna be like out in the snow but then somebody was supposed to come and take my bed apart cuz I don't know how to take the bed apart um, they're not answering the phone and I'm hoping like the movers are still gonna move my stuff tomorrow in the snow like everything is just oh. And then, okay, so it's like 12.23 right now. I text the my advisor at the dealership to see like what's going on with my car, how long it will take, and he said they haven't even seen my car yet. And it's been there since seven. Said so He said that a lot of people have been leaving because of the snow. So I don't know what's going on. Everything is just, and then my power's getting cut off in this old apartment today. I don't know what time it's going to get cut off. All I know is once it gets cut off, Morgan is leaving. I'm going to go to the new apartment. And I think I'm going to go to Lowe's or Home Depot. 
and I'm just gonna paint my wall tonight and I might like pay my brother to help me so I'm gonna paint the wall and I'm gonna be sleeping at my parents house tonight cuz I'll be bedless and powerless. Hey you guys, so I'm back at my new place. I did put my LED lights, they're so bright, um, in the kitchen. And I'm about to, uh, I, I started putting them in the bathroom, but I wanted to show y'all the difference in lighting. Turn this on. We have the LED daytime lights over here and then the regular soft white lights over here so like I love the way these lights look over here so I got this box and it was actually only $11 and this is Home Depot brand usually I get HE but I want to try these to see if they worked and they do so it's eight pack I need to get the other pack cuz I'm gonna use both I got my paint about to paint. Friends gonna come over and help me paint. It's been such a long, long day. But we're gonna make it through this day. Yes, we are. Looking all beautiful and stuff. On a moving morning. Good it morning. It is. Oh my goodness. Good morning. Hello, mother. Good. See you back there. Looking all beautiful. Looking all just woke up in the morning drinking my cup of coffee. Oh my goodness. So today is moving day. And guess what the weather's like outside? It is snowing. I'm gonna walk outside. I have shoes on. This is kind of kind of high. It's snowing outside, you guys. Look in Atlanta. This is these are not flurries. This is like legit snow. So, ooh, ooh, I'm supposed to be moving on this snowy day. <sighs> We're gonna see how this goes. <sighs> We're in the garage. My dad is snowing down the car. <gasps> Look at this nice car. Look at it. He's snowing down my car. Hi, Daddy. Oh, no, Does this just no. remind you of your childhood? Uh, you. Childhood? No. My youth. Your youth. Your my youth. youth. And then my mom's over here taking pictures, of course. Stop. Run. Bye. Bye. <laughs> so, we're trying to get the snow off. And then we're going to head over there. It's just so pretty. It smells pretty. Hello. What's happening? What's up? Are you about to play in the snow? I'm about to build a snowman. Huh? You either go to work? <laughs> Get some coffee. Talking to my neighbors. My neighbor over there. I'm sorry, I'm going to Can't really see him. <laughs> but we've been knowing him. I've known him since he was born. That snow. Oh. You have to do your car too, don't you? Oh, uh, yeah. I think it'll be okay. What? The rest of the snow? Yeah. My dad's jamming in his car. 